What is going on everybody? It is Chris coming to you with another one of my crazy crossroads. Big Joey sees with me once again, Urban Ghost, Urban Explorations. And Joe is really feeling good tonight. He, uh, he actually went and got cleansed by a pastor. We talked about it after uh, the hotel and his back, and his back's doing well. So we're in good shape. He feels great, especially because all of his felony charges were dropped. The uh, state said they couldn't even bring up charges. It was a little silly, but how happy am I for him? I know he's happy, but hey, we're at this abandoned house off of another main highway, as usual, and I have a new toy that somebody sent me. Thank you so much. I got this, uh, I got this in the mail the other day, and I'm excited about it. It's a K2 meter. I'm going to try it out in there, see what, see what goes on. So whoever sent that, I'm sorry I don't know your name off the bat, off the top of my hat, so thank you. I appreciate it. Um, we're going to go in here and see what goes on. We don't know too much information about the house, but it's abandoned. It's creepy. It's in the woods. It's whatever. We're going to have some fun tonight. See you guys inside. All right, guys, we're getting ready to head in here, but I wanted to elaborate a little more on, on what I was saying about Joe going and talking to somebody today. Um, thank you, because uh, a lot of your comments gave us some really good advice on what we should do, um, what he should do. So um, He went and talked to somebody today, and he just seems like a different person. He seems rejuvenated. I didn't realize like how messed up he really was like in the head. Well, I knew it was messed up in the head, but <laughs> not spiritually anyway. Um, so thank you for that. We really appreciate it. Um, anyway, getting ready to go into this creepy house. I just wanted to kind of, you know, elaborate a little bit more on that just to say thank you to everybody who, who helped out. And here we go. <clears throat> One of these houses with these crawl spaces. There's a lot of traffic coming by, as you guys can see. There's a place next door that's a bit We're going to check that out as well. It's way down there. A lot of traffic coming through here tonight, guys. So Joe has been here before, I think one time. So we're gonna kind of check it out. A little hole here. Yeah, Chris is checking out all these. There's a nice roach. Holes in the house. Yeah, just crawl space. Yeah. I think we should say a prayer going in like we always do and be thankful for what we have. Now when you guys watch this video, if you don't want to pray with us, I understand you can skip right over this, but it is something that we believe. So we're going to do a quick prayer. Let's do it. Let's do this prayer. All right. Dear Jesus Christ, thank you Heavenly Father for being with us tonight. We thank you for all the blessings in our lives. We ask for your protection and for the protection of everybody who watches this video. It's through you Christ that all things are possible. Amen. All right, let's do it. Creepy place. Yep. After you, my friend. All right. I shall have the honors. <laughs> okay, guys, we just got welcomed in. I mean, that door just opened. So, let's see what's in here. <laughs> it's so weird. I mean, yeah, it could have been the wind, I don't know. Uh, oh, yeah. Smell that mold. Yeah, this place is rancid. Oh, is this vintage? Hey, they have urea cream if you need some, Chris. They do. I, you know me and my urea cream. You know? Anything to get my urea, urea cleansed. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, I wonder what was here, like a little Sorry, fireplace or something? Get it. Get any, uh, Oof. Yeah, it's hot in here. <clears throat> right, oh, look at this. Look at this. What is that? It's, it's a bone. bone. It looks like... Oh, here we go. I'm not even getting it on camera. Well, uh, it looks like it, it's some kind of animal. Yeah. Freaky. It looks like uh, part of the vertebrae, maybe. 
or the spine might go through. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Well, that's fun. Who knows what kind of animal that's from? Let us know. That's weird. Yeah. Strange. Why is it right there? <laughs> All right. Subway. Just make sure we're the only ones here. Oh, look at this. So this this floor is basically there's nothing underneath this floor. That's that crawl space I was showing you before. Oh yeah, look at that. Go right through this floor. Alright. This looks like a brand new lock. There's that. Uh, Urea cream. Of course. Look at this disgusting yeah. mess in this place. Never fails. So. We don't know too much about this other than the fact that. Um, apparently, people said there might have been a lot of crimes going on, but. We don't know that to be certain. Ah, look at that. Ah, this place gets so filthy. Shameless plugs, everybody. Tito's Vodka. Little Tito's and Cran. Never hurts anyone. Sorry guys, I was zoomed in a little. Can I find that now? Ugh. So the backyard, actually behind this, it's pretty much all woods. <clears throat> this little fenced in area. Here's a little better look at the crawl space. It's like a modular home. There's another property? Yeah. Huh. Bonus. Hmm. Nope. Not yet. Where? Oh, yeah, way out there. I wonder what that is. Uh, it looks like it's some kind of building. Actually, it looks like there's a garage door. It might be a, a some shop. Some kind or of something. shop, yeah. Oh. It's kind of weird how oh, this area is fenced in. Never fails. There's always some kind of spooky tree everywhere we go. Another. Look at these trees. How oh, cool. Oh, it's so humid and hot tonight, guys. can't wait for the day we walk into a place and I go, it's not a sad place. Well, look at this light hanging. <laughs> they had the little miniature tiny table. It was a tiny person house. It's like a mansion for the tiny people. Midgets. <laughs> that's beyond midget. And that's politically incorrect, Joe. That is true. It's for small midgets. It's midgets. <laughs> <laughs> this lake is so high. Oh, yeah, this house is falling apart. Ton of water damage. <sighs> oh. Okay. Let's take a peek up here, Joey. Yeah. My see face camera. Be crazy. <laughs> <laughs> I don't want to see a face right now. I'm falling through the floor. What's up, fam? Love you guys. Oh, he's so strong. And this is a shout out so for this, you all. So this floor right here is falling through. 
All right, pretty laid back here, guys. No one's in here. There's really no evidence of anyone being in here. No. I don't think you really can stay in here with all this mold. Yeah, mold. And, man, it's hot. There's absolutely zero ventilation. There's all roaches. Ton of water damage. That's all water damage, I believe. Yeah. This place is just falling apart. Boy, I wish that window shaker was working right now. It's nasty in here. Wow, this place is tiny. Yeah, guys, this is really tiny. I haven't heard a single thing. Nothing. Did you guys get anything last time you were in here? Yeah, in that room right where you're walking. This one? Into. Mm -hmm. Literally feels like I'm going to fall right through the floor in here. It's pretty bad. That's cool, I like that. That looks like something out of a horror film. Alright guys, so one thing it's stinking hot in here, we haven't heard anything. I don't know if you can look well. I don't know. I still want to walk around and see what we capture. Maybe we'll pick up something. Kind of hang out here for a second, guys, see if we hear anything. <clears throat> Let's try this out. I'm going to put my uh, stand down. Is any spirit standing come up to the camera? Let me shut this light off. Let's see. We could try. Ooh, it's it's actually really eerie now. Yeah. Or maybe set that camera up somewhere. See? I did hear something. Should we do this meter? You wanna try the meter? Let's try. Okay. What's that? Is the needle on? Yeah. If there are any spirits in here, please make yourself known. If there's anyone or anything that wants to come through and t talk to us, please let us know. Now what's this supposed to do, Chris? Now if this... It'll pick up the frequency if there's a spirit in here. Okay. Apparently. Walk through that. Let's see if it goes off. Why don't we do this? And just put this light on its dim setting. There we go. Chris has got the meter. Let me uh, hold this here for one second, Joe. I want to put this uh, stand down a little. So what you're looking at is called a K2 meter, guys. Now, I'm no expert on these, but what I understand is 
it'll light up if there's something here. So we'll see. Alright, ready? Yep. So we're just gonna kinda walk through here and see if we catch anything, guys. <clears throat> If there are any spirits in this room, please make yourself known. Maybe we should shut the light. Shut it off. Ooh. All right, we got it in the setting so you can see a little bit. Yeah, it seems like it's pretty, pretty calm in here, buddy. Yeah. Careful with this floor, Joe. If there are any spirits in this room, we're in the back room, guys. Please make yourself known. If there's anyone here that wants to come talk to us and tell us anything, please. Do so now. Mm -hmm. I, keep hearing I thought I heard something too, yeah. But it's hard to say, some right? Things, yeah. Did that just... Did it flicker? No, no, I don't think so. Gosh, it's so hot in here, guys. there's anyone or anything in this room, any spirits that want to come to us, please let yourself know. Let yourself know. Let yourself be known. Let yourself, let yourself known. Uh, please, teach me the proper grammar. Calm. Pretty cool, huh, dude? Pretty laid back, huh? Mm -hmm. What I want to do with this? I'm going to try to do Maybe we could do a set of camera? Sure. I mean, it's, it's not picking up anything. Nothing. I mean, not a single thing. If there's anyone here that wants to tell us anything, please do so. If there's anyone here that can give us a gust of wind to get rid of this nasty, sticky humidity, please do so. <laughs> it's horrible in here, as you have no idea how hot this is. So guys, what we're doing is we're checking out to see if we get anything with the K2 meter, which we haven't got anything. I thought I heard some whispering in here, but I'm starting to think this I've been cleansed. Maybe whatever it is is not here. I don't know. <clears throat> a revelation. It's refreshing, maybe. but at the same time, I want something to happen. Yeah. You know? So. <laughs> maybe you should have waited until next week to get cleansed. Right. <laughs> I got cleansed too soon, maybe. Who knows? Damn. Joe's messing this whole thing up. And it's hot as hell in here, guys. I'm dripping sweat. All right, maybe we should try. You want to try lights out? Sure, absolutely. Maybe we'll try lights out. See if we get anything. I'm gonna kind of crouch down on the floor here with Chris. I suppose. Should I shut this off or keep this on? What your camera? No, the K2 thing. I think you should give. I don't know. It's, I don't even know how to use it, man. Not well. I don't either. But I mean, it's obviously, it's anything. not doing anything. So. 
Yeah. Oh well. Just wasting batteries on stone. Yeah. Yeah, let's kill the lights, man. Alright, we're gonna try lights out and see if we capture anything. Where's my flashlight? <clears throat> now what's what's weird is that I really don't feel anything here tonight at all. Sometimes I go to a place, a location, I'll feel stuff. Like right now, I don't feel anything at all. Kind of walking through the rooms. Yeah. Oh cool. Okay guys, so my camera just shut off, so I was at fifteen minutes or whatever, so perfect timing. I mean it's really not much. Joe was just saying how he really doesn't feel anything. I don't feel anything either, guys. <clears throat> I will tell you this much. In a kind of a little, here we go. A little, uh, hold on one second. Sorry, guys, I'm going to crank this light on. Okay, there's been, a, there's been a couple of houses since I've started doing this. A couple of areas that we actually have filmed. And we don't upload the video because there's not a lot of activity. But I will tell you this much, no matter what happens here, um, we're gonna, I'm gonna upload mine. I don't know about Joe, but I know Joe's kinda tossed a few away too, but um, we're gonna upload it. This way you guys can see what it's like if there's no activity, so. Um, I guess it's only fair. I hope you're cool with that. I think we've mentioned that before in the past too, right? Yeah. So one thing I wanted to bring up to you guys is before my camera gets some nasty stuff. But a lot of people say, hey, you guys, can you do you put up something happens and so, because sometimes we don't put videos out of people. I am gonna hang here while Joe talks for a little bit. I don't want to play with my meter, why not? I'm so sorry I forgot the gentleman's name who sent this to me. Um, oops. But I'm so grateful. I'm so excited about this. Just anything that... <laughs> I'm really grateful for everything that I get. Um, I get so many different things of uh, crystals and, and uh, jewelry. And some people have sent books. And um, I haven't gotten any shirts. But uh, I was at Joe's. Joe got some cool shirts. So, you, I mean, you guys are just so awesome for what you do. And uh, Michelle uh, Kirkland, Michelle and Dale, I believe, they sent me my first ever gift. Um, she made a comment that she's going to be sending something to my daughter, which I think is so sweet. Amelia is so excited about it. And you know what, guys? Do me a favor. If uh, I'm going to come back on me. If you guys uh, would like to see... Um, a video with my daughter just let me know um, she wants to do a video so bad but she wants to come out and do this there's no way I'm bringing her out here but. Um, just give me some ideas anything you guys want to see outside of this I'd love to do it's hot it's quiet I've never felt as comfortable as I do right now in this house so again my K2 with that being said, guys, let's see what we're uh, see what we're gonna do here and how much longer we're gonna do it. So, no matter what, your mind always hears a voice or two. But the feeling I have right now is, is awesome. It's fine. Feel good. You guys can see, but that's how close to the highway we are. Love to see what. Love to see what size the table was underneath this. Do a little quick lights out in here. Strong guys, love you. Thank you so much for all your love and support. All right, we're gonna go lights out. There he is, the new and improved Joe. Yes. Joey C. I am back. Alright, All right. let's do lights so out. Do lights out? Yeah. Might as well. You think this room would be a good lights out? Okay. This is where you said if you heard anything or saw anything. This room is where I did pick up something, so. Alright.
So we're going to do lights out, and well, I guess we'll start that now. Put my flashlight down. Alright. It's creepy being in here in the dark, but... Alright, if there's any spirits here that would like to talk to us, please let me know. Oh, man. It's weird, huh, Chris? Very strange. I thought I heard something just move. That's weird. Chris? Yeah? What the frig is that? Was that a car? Yeah. That was nothing because I was right there. Ooh, that was weird. No, I mean, I was literally <coughs> right down here. So. I was literally right here. Chuck. I just said, uh, it's, it's a lot of road noise, but it sounded like Sounded like something was squeaking or something. I'm not really sure. I mean, that's freaky as hell. And it's so freaking hot in here. Ugh. That was a car, right? Hey. Yeah, just come with me. Is that a car? It sounded like something. Like a freaking kazoo or something. I know, that's what it's not like. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe it's. Wasn't that the Fred Flintstone Martian kazoo? Yeah. Maybe it was him. That was strange. <clears throat> Alright. Alright, so we heard something that sounded like a car, but I can't wait to hear this back because it also sounded like a freaking kazoo. And it actually, you know, it was weird. It sounded like it was in the house. Yeah, well, it sounded like it was right out by this window because I was, yeah, was kind of, I'm right here the whole time, just watching down here. Yeah, did you Sounds like it's right there. Yeah, it's hot in here. All right, did you want to continue the lights out or? It doesn't matter to me, Joe. I'm good. This, I feel fine in here. Yeah? Yeah. I feel good. The creepiest thing in here could be that wagon wheel lantern. Doesn't that look like it's just something out of it a? It's like out of a restaurant, like from like the seventies. Yeah, yeah, like a, like an old. Like a, like you walk into haunted like, town, like a, like a restaurant. And they go, you want the romantic spot? They put you right under the wagon wheel. <laughs> All right, well. All right, guys. So this was my first day back, and. I'm curious, I think I heard some voices in here, we're not going to stay in here while there's really nothing going on here, but... <clears throat> yeah, I don't know if you guys heard, which I'm sure you did, but... Wow, look at this. It's went like crazy. We're, we're, there's nothing going on in here, guys. We don't want to drag this out too long. So, uh... We will, uh... Wrap it up in here. And, uh, on to the next one. Next video, so... I think you guys are gonna see this because I'm gonna I'm gonna put mine up regardless. You get to see how bad I'm sweating. It's nasty. But I'm stepping out to get some air. <clears throat> All right, guys. So that's it. I'm, like I said, there's nothing really going on in here. Usually, you get a really bad sense right when you walk in. This one. There was no sense at all that was bad, um, outside of it being really hot, nasty, and humid. Um, it's fine in here, so we're going to move on, call it a night. Uh, it just doesn't make sense to waste any more footage on here. But, um, as always, guys, thank you so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed this. I know it's not too exciting. Um, but, who knows, you guys can listen back and hear some things, and I can listen and hear some things, so... We kind of thought we heard a little voice, but nothing crazy, and we heard a kazoo, so. <laughs> so the kazoo's, the kazoo's on the loose now. But guys, check out the shirt, see his crazy crossroad. Um, thank you guys for all the merchandise that you've been purchasing, the cameos, all that good stuff. I really, really love you guys so much. I'm so grateful for you. Um, please, see down below, subscribe, share, like, 
give me a couple of thumbs up. You know, I love it. Um, and we will see you guys next time. Thank you so much. Love you. Peace.